Hi friends, today's topic of discussion is friction disk type planar feed drive. The automatic feed drive for a planar are provided by two methods by friction disk by electric drive. Here we will be discussing friction disk type planar feed drive. It consists of friction disk D at the bottom and rack and pinion drive at the top. The friction disk D is connected to a table drive shaft. A T slot is cut radially on the face of feed disk within which a block B slide over the screwed shaft. At the end of the screwed shaft is a knurled knob K which can be turned to adjust the position of block B. The sliding block is connected to the connecting rod. The connecting rod is connected to the rack. The projecting pin is connected to the disc body. When the table drive shaft starts rotating during the cutting stroke, the motion is transmitted to the disc. The projecting pin hits the fixed pin P1 which is fitted to the machine body. The disc starts slipping even though the drive shaft continues to rotate. When the table is reversed, the disc rotates through the same angle in the opposite direction. The projecting pin hits the second fixed pin that is P2. The rotary motion of the feed disc is transmitted through rack R to pinion L which is mounted on shaft S1. G1 and G2 are also mounted on shaft S1. But G2 is keyed to the shaft S1 while G1 is free. There is a double pole okay, and which functions in such a way that during the clockwise motion G1 and G2 both rotate but while anti-clockwise motion only G2 rotates G1 does not rotate. So during the upward motion of the rack during the upward motion of the rack G2 rotates in the clockwise direction G2 is rotating in the clockwise direction and also G1 rotates in the clockwise direction this is because of the pole connection downward motion of the rack so G2 gear will rotate in the anti-clockwise direction but G1 does not rotate this is because the slipping motion of the pole. Gear G1 meshes with G3 and G4 which is mounted on the shaft S2 and S3 which are down feed and cross feed shaft of the planer. So the feed motion is transmitted to the tool heads by shaft S2 and S3. So this was friction disc type planar feed drive. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching.